So next, all we need to do is rename the job. And then we can either click run, or we can click and hold the job settings button. So here we can specify the results to be incorporated into the project table appended as a new group. And we can separate the job into multiple subjobs. In this case, we'll use 10 subjobs. Now, if there are 50 ligands to dock, then that means in each subjob, there will be five ligands being docked. And here we have four processors on the local host. So we'll use all four of them. So in this case, the 10 subjobs will be distributed over the four processors. When ready, we'll click save and run. The job should only take a couple of minutes.